I want to talk to those 70% of American citizens that choose to stay at home on election day. What you don't understand is that along with citizenship comes responsibilities. Your major responsibility is to vote. We have soldiers that protect that right for you to vote. And they pledge to this country that when necessary, they will put themselves in harm's way. So you have the right to vote. You understand what I'm saying? They will give up themselves for this country. As a Vietnam veteran, I've seen that pledge carried out in real time. Soldiers lose their lives, they lose their limbs, and some lose their minds. And you tell me you don't have time to vote? If you don't see the value in voting for yourself, then vote for a fallen soldier. Google fallen soldiers. World War II, Korean War, my brother died in the Korean War, you can, uh, the Vietnam War, the Iraqi War, pick a name, any name, and vote in their honor. When you go to the polls and you finish voting, tell those people, that, that individual that you have voted in his honor and you pledge that you will vote every opportunity that you can in his honor, in his remembrance or her remembrance. Your vote counts whether you make seven twenty-five an hour or you're a billionaire. You get one vote. That's the beauty. I got to get out of here and pound on some doors. I'm going to see you on the other side of the election. Are you going to be able to look in my eye and, and, and with pride or are you going to look away in shame because you didn't vote?